your full-time job it is is it your only job and it's really not my only job I manage taxis with my mom I'm also now a licensed realtor and I just have you know regular day-to-day -day things that I like to do so for today we're gonna go open up a bank account at Sajikor we're also gonna go to NHT and get some proper forms because I want to be a contributor my mom is so we want to put that together so we can buy a house together um, which is a very smart idea if you have you know multiple people in your family or if your boyfriend girlfriend husband wife sister brother uncle niece nephew whatever if you want to put your NHT together you can have more money to buy a property together so just to list it off again, we're going to go to the bank, we're going to go to NHT. Also, some issues came up with the taxi and one of our previous drivers, so I won't get into detail about it, but I do have to go to the courthouse and file a summons, so I'll bring you guys along just to see what the process is like. But please do not bring up anything in the comments, I'm not going to talk about it. Um, just want to tell you what I'll be doing. And then after that, I have a video to edit, so I technically will be doing influencer work, but... It is what it is and then I have some real estate stuff that I want to do maybe go look at some land in Linstead with Paul and get some drone footage of that so I might do that and I might throw that in but if I don't then I'll just find another day where I can show you how to buy land in Jamaica so if you're interested in seeing that video then drop a comment down below and let me know all right guys just finished parking but a good tip is to remember which floor like actually look out for the number or the letter of the floor so when you're done you don't get completely confused and combobulated about where you parked so here we are and you see in the new kingston kingston area it's literally right next to emancipation park right next to the marriott hotel so not too hard to find Let's just see if I have to join this line or what I'll have to do. Guys! The, um, the department that I was coming to relocated. So I'm gonna find myself to Crossroads. Um, I didn't know, I didn't know. I don't know. So if you're watching, don't come here if you want to do voluntary contribution. I'm going to put up the picture of the new location, at least the address of the new location. So save your time and go to Crossroads. Um, I don't know. I don't think I saw it on their website, but then again, I wasn't really looking for... I just knew this as the location to go. So we're going to head upstairs. 
get in the car and see what we can do to get to Crossroads. Also, the security guard recognized me, which big up to you if you end up watching this video. But I was wearing my mask. Like, can you guys, would you guys have recognized? Do you recognize me? I don't know. Maybe it's the hair. <laughs> All right, guys. Just finished with NHT. I gave out so much cards. It's crazy how I still have cards left. I'm just kidding. I didn't give out as much, but I do want to give out more and more cards just to try to get business. But I'm terrible at my emails and I'm terrible at following up. So if you have any advice, I don't have the funds to get a secretary. People are telling me to do that. I don't have the funds for that. So if you have any advice, let me know. <laughs> fast through anyways let's go to our second location because we're definitely in the area we're gonna head to Sajikor get an application not an application get a account with them so NHT the only thing that kind of you know blew me out the park was that the location changed um, even someone was inside and she was like you guys should let the public know you should let the public know that you've changed location because i guess she went really really far and that's when she found out so i definitely agree with her um that was it they were very very nice uh very helpful the form was real easy to fill out and they're going the technology route so they're gonna email me the information that I need, which I'm eternally grateful for. Um, I'm gonna try to make my way to New Kingston now. So, pray for me. They recently renovated a supermarket. I believe it is this place. Yes, it is this place. I guess there's East Japanese, a Japanese restaurant, a little Tokyo and a little supermarket there. So maybe I'll check it out when I'm coming back outside. Seven Spices. Oh, that's the Indian place that Gypsy put me and Anisha onto. Um, but anyways, let's head on in. Here in the line, which bank is not known to have a line? Um, some people are saying they've been waiting here a while, so hopefully it doesn't take too long. Um, honestly, I just want to why is wise opening a bank account in Jamaica so difficult? Like, they're telling me that my job letter from Century 21 may not be enough. And they're also telling me that my letter from my landlord, which is handwritten, may not be enough as a proof of proof of um proof of address. But the thing is I just moved there within the past two weeks. I don't have a bill yet with my name on it. So I'm going into the car because I feel like I have the physical letter. I just have a e-document version of it. So let me check. Oh, it's just crazy. Like, oh my god, I need to call call and uh, okay. I have I have this 
this paper from NHT, not NHT, from, from um, JPS. But I don't think I have the written letter that she gave me. Let me check. Digicel accepted. Boy! I'm gonna want this job. Digicel accepted this green paper because I don't have any receipt. I don't have any proof of um I don't have no proof of utility yet so i don't even have a digital bill yet so they might send me away that's what she's telling me but i'm trying to pull out all the documents so she can let me know because she said she doesn't want me to wait which they have good customer service like the security guard wasn't rude like other places where the security guard have attitudes um and the, the customer service um representative she's really nice so when i give them them coins anyways i'm gonna go back inside and show her that this is this is the physical copy that i have and if they don't want to take it then i guess i'm just gonna have to come back when i have an actual um utility bill Sorry. thank you have a good day they were amazing it was the customer service was just everything um she was so nice i'm gonna try to stop by jps and get some type of um like proof of um proof, proof of address from them via like a bank statement not bank statement the uh i'm so combagulated guys give me a second so what i was trying to say is uh um, it's been a long day via a printout of what my bank, not what my bill payment would look like with my name and my email. So, yeah, I said I was gonna come check out this place really quickly, but the security guard just spotted that I'm here and not over there. But I just want to see what it looks like real quick, you know, and I want to show you guys as well because Kyle said the place is real nice, but anyways, I think he's ready to go. But, um, it's really cute. He's watching me. Anywho, um, they were just, they were really nice. Like, I, when customer service is nice in Jamaica, it's nice. Anywho, let me just walk around and try to show you guys. So, I went to the bank, went to NHT. I didn't get to go look at the listing with Paul, unfortunately. Um, I also didn't get to go do the summons, so I'm just going to try to do that as early as possible tomorrow because it really and truly shouldn't take long. Alright guys, it's literally the next morning, but I really wanted to throw this in to show you because I don't know how many of you guys have been to court before. I'm downtown, so I need to be careful with my phone, but it's pretty empty streets. I'm going to show you what the courthouse is looking like and then tell you about my experience after. Alrighty, so I understand rules are rules. Um, every country is different. Um, it's still. You really get them a nice ratings, isn't it? Anywho, so that was that with regards to the courthouse and filing the summons. So I'm just gonna have to go back tomorrow morning and just bring the bring the stamp and bring the evidence that i have and yeah that's all i've got to say see you in the next clip i just had to get these two things out the way because i know i know that one will come through i'm also going to meet with the police officer tomorrow um i'm actually gonna head home now just do a bit of work at home, shower, eat, and uh, I'm gonna stay at home for the rest of the night. Just on some real stuff, watch some movies, something on Netflix. But I'm going to show you what it would look like if I did go out, um, you know, just enjoy my time. Obviously, I was filming because I want to show you. So I was being an influencer in part, but 
I'm gonna show you what it looks like when I go out just a little party and then when I also go out to just hang out with Chad and eat some food and live life so yeah I'll see you guys when I reach home Peace out. so I made a quick stop to the supermarket because I wanted to just get some stuff to meal prep for um to meal prep for the week not the week the weekend because it's wednesday i believe so just for tomorrow and friday um i really wanted to go to the supermarket and get these things but if i can find something light like even this this big piece of pumpkin can go on 115 dollars I just want something to make, you know, for myself. And then come back over. Oh, they have, um... I want to start doing, um, some more vegan meal options. So I've learned that you can use mushrooms as, like, a meat replacement. You just season it, like, how you season meat. And it has the, um, the flavor and the texture. It's three sixty one for a piece of mushroom i'm gonna have to find some mushroom somewhere else what i also wanted to do so i'm gonna take some cucumbers this one is 159 they look honestly better than the other ones that i'm seeing i want to okay come on. i want to um do some fruit infused water so let's see what else we can find. I want to buy some um, seeds and plant my own because this is getting ridiculous. Is that tofu? What is that? Ugh. I don't know. I tried tofu, but maybe it's the way it was seasoned. I just did not like how it tasted. But it's $370. It's a meat replacement. I just don't like tofu. I'd rather use a vegetable as a meat replacement. So sorry, I'm moving fast. I have some grocery shopping videos if you're interested in seeing those. Um, they're there. I'll also link them up here. I just want to get in and get out. So this is the new supermarket. I've showed you it a little bit with Anisha, but it's a cute one, you know? I need a one soap. I've been using these soaps with no shame not this one i'm going to try the castile one i'm going to try the castile one for some reason body wash hasn't been working well with me so i've been using the liquid one not the liquid the cake soap one <laughs> All right, let's see. I'm just looking for the canned goods. When I find it, I'll come back. Alrighty, guys. So I'm home. I got the cucumbers, cucumber. Uh, I got pumpkin, and I got potato. What I'm gonna oops, what I'm gonna do later on today? Let me let me show you what else I got. So I also got the kernel corn, and I got a soap. You saw that the bill came up to one thousand one hundred and seventy six dollars. So it's really good. Some of my green peppers is going bad, so I'm gonna put them in the fridge. 
I'm gonna use I'm gonna try to use this and this two of these tonight and put this in the fridge. Well, I'm just gonna put the whole thing in the fridge then. Um, I also have some tomatoes. I'm just gonna try to make some type of vegetable stew. I have baked beans, which I really love. I really love baked beans. I'm gonna use probably some garlic, some onion. I'll also probably use either some molasses or some brown sugar just to give it a sweet taste, but only a little bit. And cook some white, white, white rice and just have that for my next couple days meal. Um, I'll be doing breakfast because I have my eggs and stuff. I was going to buy pear, but I want to buy them something at the market because it's too expensive in the supermarket. to end off the vlog however i did finish editing a whole entire video created my thumbnail created my description finished the whole season of a show it is literally 1 14. yeah this is what it's looking like so make sure you go over and watch it i'll leave it in the screen somewhere so pay attention to wherever my finger is pointing I hope you've enjoyed the video. If you haven't watched it yet, then just tap the little eye up in the top corner and go check out that video. I'm going to head off to bed. So that's basically what I do when I'm not influencing. I mean, I still be influencing, but yeah, I'm ending off this video here. And I hope you like that little part of me going out. That's what I would do. And if I'm not going out, I'm at home chilling. So I'll see you guys in the next vlog not my crooked nails <laughs> embarrassment are you not embarrassed i am i'm not gonna be doing this finger anymore peace out guys have a great night have a great morning